Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to share with you guys a Dollar Tree haul. Now this is not anything specific. It's just a bunch of random stuff that I personally have never seen before. So if that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. I am so excited to be here with you guys. I know this is impromptu. I'm not going to edit this video because I just want to get it up for you guys. Happy Saturday. I love you guys so much. So I'm just going to grab at random. Um, these are items that I found like last week. It's I didn't find anything today, but I've been wanting to film a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. And the weather is gorgeous tonight. Plus, I have this absolutely stunning backdrop. So I was like, why not? Um, my little Isabella, she's two, about to be three next month. I can't believe how fast time flies, y'all. So she's playing and here we are. So you might hear a little one in the background. I know you guys don't mind, but I just wanted to let you know if you hear a little one, that's why. So first things first, I have never seen this before. <gasps> Look at it. It says love lives here and it does have a little light on it. So... It has this faux wood grain. Now it is just like a cheap little sticker, but it's a little wooden box. And this light did pop out. So I guess if you were like wanting to put something else in there, I don't really know, but the light does pop out. So I did pick up one of those. I love that little house with the hearts and then the wood, that's what, I don't really like the saying love lives here. I mean, I do, but anyway, I really liked the design. Mommy, I want a shelly. I want shelly. Yeah? You look so silly. You look so silly. The next item I picked up <laughs> is I needed this little pad of paper. Uh, my kids always steal my pads of paper. So I had to get a new one. This one says, get it done. I loved that it has like the week and then um, work life, home life. So it has a few different, um, you know, spots for things to get done. Um, and this was in the new school supply section. So right now they're bringing out all the school supplies and stuff. That is where I found this pad of paper. And as always, let me know down in the comments which item was your favorite. Let me shut this light off. Okay. I also picked up this pad of paper because if you guys know me, if you have never met me before and this is your first time here, hey, hi, how you doing? I'm Melissa and I'm very spiritual. So this really called to me. I saw it. It says, it says, stay wild, moon child. Now this one I did get in the regular office supply section. And I love the fact that it has a magnet on the I back. Look you look so silly. I love the fact that it has a magnet on the back to go on the fridge. So there's that. Let me know in the comments, are you guys spiritual? I would love to know. I feel like I attract a lot of people that are spiritual just because you tend to attract your own kind when you're real and raw and honest and you show up as your true authentic self you end up attracting yourself pretty much so that's the only reason i was asking the next item i picked up were these rub on transfers now these are not new but y'all know that the fall crafting season is coming really fast um that will start beginning of august um, I also have some really, really, really fun stuff coming. So stay tuned for that. I am working with my dream brand. Um, so yeah, can't wait. So I got these and again, I thought that they would be perfect for fall DIYs. So, and the other thing is, this is not gonna be a huge haul. Um, it's not a whole bunch of stuff, but I did just want to, um, let you guys know so this one is an adult luau skirt now again this is not a new item but i wanted to bring to your attention how much raffia is on this hula skirt 
like not only is it a lot sorry y'all bugs are like i hate bugs does anybody else hate bugs let me know um not only is it a lot but the strands are nice and straight so if you want to make a bow or whatever it's going to be a lot easier to work with i should have picked up a couple packs so i will probably try to go back and get more so i picked up one of those and then again these are not new i said that these were new items oh my goodness <sighs> these are not new but i do have some ideas for christmas diys and fall diys so picked up two packs of those okay now these are new Dollar Tree's getting so good, you guys. Like, so good. It says, Home, Family, Friends. Home, a story of who we are, a collection of things we love. Family, the people you live for, laugh with, and love the most. Miss Bella. Okay. What are you doing, silly goose? I hate school. <laughs> Y'all, she has her little scooter, and I've never seen a two-year-old so good at scooting. <laughs> Is that the right word? I have never seen a two-year-old as good at scooting as her. Scootering? Is it scootering? Scooting? I don't know. Anyway, she took the scooter up to the top of the steps and then just let it drop. No, we're not going to do that no more, please. Sorry about that. Mom life. Okay. Okay. Family, the people you live for, oh, laugh daddy. with, and love most. One of life's greatest oh, blessings. Daddy. I see you, beautiful. Good job. Friends, people whom one knows, loves, and trusts. And I loved the greenery and, like, the design, the black with the wood, and then the greenery and this. I just, I just love it. They did so good. <gasps> And I will pop up a picture if I remember. They have a whole section of new signs. Um, bee decor, farmhouse with like um, buffalo check ribbon on the side with bows. I mean, y'all, they are getting good. They even have signs with like greenery on them. Like little, they made a little wreath out of the greenery. Now, it looks kind of cheap, but for a dollar twenty-five, like... Hell yeah. Okay, one of those. And then along and then along like the same line, I picked up a wooden plain one. Now this was the only one that I could find. So I did just um grab the one. I did look out for more, but this was the only one I could find. And it is just like the longer signs. Um, but they just like cut them up and put them like this so one of those and then I also picked up look how gorgeous this wall creations is what it's called wall creations wall sticker whatever um and in the little picture it has it like under a shelf but I'm not sure what I would do with that so I picked it up and we'll see what we come up with so again, I picked up one of those. Did I say that? I don't know. Oh no, I picked up two. <laughs> I picked up two, okay. Well, y'all know if you've been around for any length of time, you know your girl is a mess, okay? And then I also picked up, I also picked up some more of these. I have some more. Projects in mind, y'all absolutely loved the projects that I did with these. So I will be bringing you more of these. So I did pick up one, two, five. And they did have a bunch of different colors now of these. So again, if I remember, I'll pop it up for you guys. You, now, Mama. you're welcome, baby. Now, at my dollar stores, they don't have any fall Mama. stuff out other than the florals. Bye-bye, Sweet Pea. Other than the florals. I love, you. I love you more, Sweet Pea. And so I picked up one red or burgundy, whatever you would like to call it. But I just loved the detail, the little um, wheat and the little berries on it. 
<gasps> oh my gosh. And they're called wheat. And then I also got the same uh, three more in the like mustard color. Look how gorgeous that is for fall, you guys. And at Dollar Tree, like give me more Dollar Tree. I love it. I love it. I love it. I can't wait to make a wreath or like embellish some projects with that. Let me know. Do you guys love these florals or are you not a big fan? So all together, I got four of these. That would even be beautiful in a vase, no, just no, like no. that. No, no, flowers. no, no more flowers. You don't need to pick mommy's flowers. Mommy needs them for projects. You want to say hi? Mm -hmm. well, hello, my friends. I want these ones. Yeah, they're mama friends. My friends. Oh, they're your friends? Yeah. You think so? Yeah. Can I have a kiss? Love you. Go play. <gasps> All right, I gotta hurry because I'm losing sunlight. And then again, these are old news. Some rocks. Um, these are just like white, mine. just like white rocks, and the bigger black rocks. I'm kind of confused, like why the bags are a different size. But anyway, one of each of those. And the moment you've all been waiting for. New calendars, 2024 calendars. So this one locally grown with the barn and the windmills, like holy crap, they, they got that on point. And then on the back, you've got the goat and cheese, love, hello spring, I love that. There's the locally grown, the rooster, home sweet home, um, the milk and cream company, butcher's guide, wild and free, hello October. Look how gorgeous that is. These three, like love, love, love. Hello October, count your blessings, enjoy. So that's one. And then the second one, <gasps> farm life. Isn't that cow so beautiful with the background and the um, florals? Oh my gosh. Now I have seen a few of these images before. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think we have seen all of these images, but I do believe like, I know I've seen this one before for a fact. I feel like I've seen this one. I don't know. Is this a new one or is this an older one? Because I know for a fact that I've seen some of these images, but I can't remember if they're all brand new or it's just a repeat of a different calendar and they just slap 2024 on it and like change. You get what I'm saying? I don't know. But I felt like they were new. I felt like I've never seen them before, but you know how my mind is. I could be wrong. So I picked up a few of each of these. So in lieu of that, you guys know my heart and you know how I am. So let's do a fun little giveaway. Um, I will pick two winners and all you have to do is just be subscribed to the channel, share this video out, type the word shared in the comment section, and then drop your favorite farm animal. And we will pick a winner in just a couple days. I will leave all the information in the description box below, as well as the pinned comment. So make sure you guys check out that info to make sure that you follow the rules and that way you know when I will pick a winner. So I love giving back to you guys. None of this would be possible without you. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you every single day, just for being there, being my friend, being my support, um, and just supporting me and loving me and giving me grace every day. Like, I don't think you understand how much I am so grateful for that. So that is all of the Dollar Tree stuff. Now I did pick up some paint brushes from Walmart. 
um, while we were out and about. And I have never seen these before. And y'all, I'm a Walmart regular, okay? Um, so I know what's what. And these are brand new. So it's that new Hello Hobby brand. Oh my God, excuse me. <laughs> Drank my ketones too fast before I came out here. Um, so I picked up a few of these synthetic chip brushes. These are for smooth paint, not for like dry brushing and stuff. So I picked up a few of those. I picked up a few of the bigger ones and then a few of the like smaller ones. So I wanted to tell y'all look out for these cause they seem to be really good, but I can't, I can't speak on the quality just yet cause I haven't used them, but I will let you guys know if you're curious. So, oh, okay, this is the last item from Dollar Tree. I'm sorry. I took them out of the pack because, of course, my kids wanted to use them. But if you guys have never used Zebra brand from Dollar Tree, I absolutely love their supplies, especially their pencils because they make the really, um, these are the .5, and that's the type of lead that I like to write with. I also like to write with .5 pens. I don't know what it is. I'm a pen freak. I only like a certain kind. They got to write a certain way. I don't know. Is Am I the only weirdo? But like, I, it's just a thing, you guys. I don't know what that is. So that is finally it. With that being said, thank you guys for sticking around. Thank you for hanging with us. If nobody has told you today, you are absolutely stunning. You are worthy. You are gorgeous. You can literally do anything you set your mind to. Coming from an addict who is nine years sober, I know that if I can do it, you can do it as well. I also know that I'm going to get questions about my sheds, so I'm just going to give you guys the rundown real quick, okay? I already know that question is coming. So, <sighs> we had my she shed, okay? My she shed, my crafty she shed is right there, and we knew that when we moved to this house, we were going to need extra storage because it doesn't have a whole lot of storage. So, we ended up buying those two right there, like the exact identical um of mine and we were just going to put them all side by side but hoa had a problem with that they were trying to make us move all of our sheds all the way to the back of our property and the problem is that's my work so i could i can't imagine going back and forth the way that i do now from like right here to right here inside of my door and in the HOA, it says that you can have one building. And so my husband was like, you know what? I'm just going to put them all together. And it's one building now. So it was kind of a spite thing. Um, when we moved here, we were told that the HOA was not active because the uh, neighborhood was still being completed and nobody was in charge of the HOA. Um, and then later on when we got our sheds, we found out a different story. So we had already paid for them. They were either trying to make us take them back or go to the end of the property. So there's a clause that says you can have a one building. It doesn't say what size, what it doesn't specify any of that. It just says one building. So, um, we put them together and now they can't tell us anything. Not only that but we have tons of storage now and if you know anything about my job and dollar tree like you can never ever ever have enough storage right so anyway that's the spiel about my sheds again it's okay i know people are curious i'm the same way so i wanted to just tell you guys but with that being said i love you guys so much thank you for everything and i will catch y'all in the next one bye Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here.